going on everyone got a brand new movie review for you guys today and today we're discussing Paul Dano's directorial debut Wildlife. Wildlife stars Jake Gyllenhaal and Carrie McGillan and it's about a boy played by Ed Oxenbold who witnesses his parents marriage start to fall apart after his mother finds another man. Now this is a very special type of movie. Uh, it's a heartbreaking film at times and it's very emotional and very realistic but man, round of applause for Paul Dano as a directorial debut. This film is excellent. As excellent as this film is, I don't exactly know where to start at. But what I can for sure say is that the second this film opens up, there's this father-son bonding moment where they're just playing catch. It's a very sweet moment, but it's just them playing catch. And in that opening shot, I knew, I knew this was going to be something special. And something special, it very much was. It's not just because of the performances. Now, don't get me wrong. Ed Oxenberg gives a fantastic job as this kid. Jake Gyllenhaal's always superb. But out of all the performances, it's Carrie McGillan's performance as the wife who just outstandingly steals the whole entire show from every single person. It gives easily the best performance of her. Her career. I'm going to name someone who does overtop her as the film star. It is Paul Dano's direction in here. It's very subtle and it's very simplistic at times, but it doesn't feel like any other director's style. It feels like someone new style, something new that I've never seen before from a drama. And Paul Dano handles that and stamps his name onto this film. It feels like him. It's a directorial debut. It doesn't feel like any other director's type of movie. And I love that Paul Dano did that with this type of movie. This is very much one of those films that in a sense, yeah, it's a basic story we've heard before. It's nothing original. We hear this all the time. It's a very real story though and it feels real in that because I'm very fortunate enough. I've never gone through divorce. My family, my parents are still happily married but the thing is is I have had tons of friends go through divorce. I've had tons of co-workers who have gone through divorce and I've seen the pain and emotions that can go through with it and I can't imagine. You see it's all through the kids eyes and what's going on and Paul Dano really sat down there. It feels like a very much a true story and maybe this is Paul Dano's childhood. Maybe he was writing it through to be through this kid and being that idolistic like impressions from the kid because that's what the, the film feels like it's all from this kid's point of view and it's heartbreaking at times to see him and all the different emotions that he has to show and go to school and go to his job and it's emotional it's a very emotional film that it never got me to the point of crying but I was so invested with this son and with these characters wanting the parents to figure out their marriage wanting to figure out what's going to happen and feeling disgusted by the mom and who she ends up with with this guy it, it's so gross but it's real and that's what Paul Dano struck within me and this film is simplistic it's very sweet in its telling but it's so unique in the way that the story is told it's a story that we've heard multiple times before but in the way that it's portrayed in the way that it's put in front of you and captured into your eyes it's something special Paul Dano really did an excellent job directing this film with getting such great performances from each and every actor in here something special to say the least and I can't not wait to see what Paul Dano does next. So with all that said, I'm going to give Wildlife an A-. Please search this one out, guys. So if you guys are interested in seeing it, it's coming out this weekend. Check it out, guys. Also, if you guys are new here, hit that like and subscribe button down below so we can talk more nerdy and geek culture down below. Because that's what this community is for. That's what this channel's for. It's to talk movies like this. Talk independent superheroes, whatever you guys want to talk about. Tell me what your guys' thoughts are on Wildlife. Let's discuss it down below. And also, if you're new here, hit up Sandwich on Films also down there. Because right down there, you guys can get into advanced movie scenes, even check out some movie news, and even some movie reviews. But of course, until next time, stay classy. We'll